Welcome to the Awesome Possum Classroom Daily Kindergarten Phonics. This is week five, lesson four. A rhyme is a repeated sound in two or more words, like the at sound in cat, hat, and bat. Pace, race. Do you hear the ace sound in the word pace and race? Pace and race are rhyming words. Repeat after me, pace, race. Good job, now it's time to practice. Listen as I say the two rhyming words. Repeat them back to me. If the words rhyme, give me a thumbs up. If they don't rhyme, give me a thumbs down. Hail, mail. Thumbs up. Main, rain. Thumbs up. Drink, stink. Thumbs up. Draw, win. Thumbs down. Skunk, chunk. Thumbs up. Nice job. Now let's work on beginning sounds. Listen for the first sound in the word. Run. What sound do you hear at the beginning of run? Say the sound, not the letter. Er, very good. Let's practice. What do you, what sound do you hear at the beginning of doctor? Duh. What sound do you hear at the beginning of money? Mmm. What sound do you hear at the beginning of gas? G. What sound do you hear at the beginning of quiet? Qua. What sound do you hear at the beginning of umbrella? Uh. Nice job. Now, let's practice blending to make words. Blending to make words means we put all the word parts together to make a new and bigger word. Sis. Sister, sister, do you hear the two parts in sister? Sister. Now you try it. Repeat after me. Sister, sister. Nice. Let's practice. I will say two or three syllables. Say the syllables back to me and blend them together to say a whole word. All right, the first word, it has three syllables in it. It's beautiful. Repeat that, please. Blend it together, and what is the word? Beautiful. Repeat after me. Zip, purr. Blend it together, and what is the word? Zipper. Repeat after me. Table. Blend it together and what is the word? Table. All right, the next word has three syllables. To may toe. Repeat that, please. Blend it together and what is the word? Tomato. The next word has three syllables. Repeat after me. Dinosaur. Blend it together and what is the word? Dinosaur. Nice job. Now we will work on ending sounds. Listen for the last sound you hear in the word. Tough. What sound do you hear at the end of tough? Say the sound, not the letter. Very good. Now let's practice. What sound do you hear at the end of blurt? T. What sound do you hear at the end of brick? K. What sound do you hear at the end of dip? P. 
What sound do you hear at the end of acorn? Mm. What sound do you hear at the end of elbow? Oh, good job. Now let's practice segmenting. Segmenting means listening to the whole word and then breaking it down into smaller parts. Today. Today. Do you hear the two parts in the word today? Today. Repeat after me. Today. Today. Very good. Now I'm going to say a word. You're going to say it back to me, and then you're going to segment it back to me in syllables. Repeat after me. Beautiful. All right. Beautiful has three syllables. Try and break beautiful down into three syllables for me. Beautiful. Repeat after me. Zipper. Zipper has two syllables. Break zipper down for me. Zip per. Repeat after me. Table. Table has two syllables. Break it down for me. Table. All right. Repeat after me. Tomato. Tomato has three syllables. Break it down for me. Tomato. Good job. Repeat after me. Dinosaur. Dinosaur has three syllables. Break it down for me. Dine. No sore. Excellent. All right, now we're going to add a syllable to the end of a word. We can add a syllable at the end of a word to make a new word. Say melt. Add to the end of the word. And what is the word? Melted. Good job. Say wilt. Add to the end of the word. And what is the word? Wilted. Say turn. Add to the end of the word. And what is the new word? Turned. Say plant. Add to, to the end of the word. And what is the word? Planted. Say twist. Add to the end of the word. And what is the word? Twisted. Say rent. Add to the end of the word. And what is the word? Rented. Good job. Now we'll take away a syllable and say what is left. Say called. Without the d, what is left? Call. Good job. Say wilted. Without the d, what is left? Wilt. Say turned. Without the d, what is left? Turn. Good job. Say planted. Without the d, what is left? Plant. Say twisted. Without the d, what is left? Twist. Say rented. Without the d, what is left? Rent. Good job. All right, so now we're going to change syllables. We can change a syllable to make a new word. Say easy. Change the e's to run, and the word is runny. Easy, runny. Do you hear that? All right. Say handed. Change hand to wait, and the word is 
weighted. Say weighted. Change weight to seat, and the word is seated. Say seated. Change seat to pound, and the word is pounded. Say pounded. Change pound to rent, and the word is rented. Say rented. Change rent to shout, and the word is shouted. Let's learn the alphabet. We can learn letter names and letter sounds. Each letter has a name and a sound. I will ask you the letter and then the sound the letter makes. Are you ready? Let's go. What is the letter? F. What is the sound? F. What is the letter? A. What is the sound? A. Ah. What is the letter? I. What is the sound? I. What is the letter? B. What is the sound? B. What is the letter? D. What is the sound? D. What is the letter? G. What is the sound? G. What is the letter? L. What is the sound? L. What is the letter? H. What is the sound? <sighs> what is the letter? K. What is the sound? K. What is the letter? N. What is the sound? N. What is the letter? E, what is the sound? E. What is the letter? J, what is the sound? J. What is the letter? O, what is the sound? Ah. What is the letter? Q, what is the sound? Qua. What is the letter? C, what is the sound? K. What is the letter? R, what is the sound? R. What is the letter? P. What is the sound? P. What is the letter? S. What is the sound? S. What is the letter? U. What is the sound? Uh. What is the letter M? What is the sound? M. Mm. What is the letter V? What is the sound? V. What is the letter Z? What is the sound? Z. What is the letter? W. What is the sound? W. 
What is the letter? X. What is the sound? X. What is the letter? T. What is the sound? T. What is the letter? Y. What is the sound? Y. Now let's practice our sight words. On each slide, a sight word will appear. You will have three seconds to repeat the sight word before a new word will appear. Two. The. A. R. A. The. R. And. R. Two. And. R. Now it's time to practice a nursery rhyme with your teacher. Your teacher will say a line. You will say the line and clap the number of words in the line. Count how many words are in each line. Circle the sight words. Count the syllables in the words and underline the rhyming words. At this time, teachers, pause the video so that you can complete this activity with your class. Thank you for working along with the Awesome Possum Classroom. See you tomorrow.